Welcome to this episode of White Glove Geography. Today we're going to look at development indicators and in particular the literacy rate as a development indicator. Previously, in a different video, we had an overview of different development indicators. So we have GNI, birth rate, death rate, infant mortality, life expectancy, people per doctor, education, reading and writing, access to safe water, and also HDI, a composite development indicator. So we've looked before at the literacy rate is measured as a percentage of the population in the country that have basic reading and writing skills. This is a really useful one because it talks about uh, how much money the government will invest in education and also uh, how that is applied because it's to do with opportunity and how are people are going to use that education. Here's some of the problems with that particular indicator. One is the reliability of the data. Different governments, as they collect the data, may have different uh, cutoff points of what they consider to be basic reading and writing skills. Another one is the collection of data. So in some areas, it might be more difficult, say in conflict areas, uh, where there's squatter settlements or maybe where there's high levels of migration, to actually collect the data and make sure it's accurate and up to date. Whilst literacy is a good measure of people's basic skills in terms of reading and writing, this measure doesn't take into account other skills that people might have in our ICs, lower income countries, such as maybe farming skills, other practical skills that may actually be a lot more useful uh, on that particular day to those people. So we have literacy rates and this is a good measure. It's a percentage of the number of people in the country that can read and write and it's the number of adults that can read and write uh, to a basic level. Some of the limitations are the reliability of the data, the consistency of the data, there might be some difficulties collecting the data and it doesn't take into account some of the other skills that people might have. Thank you for watching this episode about development indicators to do with literacy rates. That was on White Gulf Geography.